ちゃ可愛い。昨日の一枚に帯三本って。うん。これはなんか見たのとつけたのとでやっぱ違う。うん、本当にそう。皆さんこんにちは。And welcome to Let's Ask Shogo. It's me, Shogo, and I have my wife, Harumi. Hi. Our daughter, Nagi. Hey. And also, Tomoko. Hello. All right. So, today, guys, we're going to be taking you here to Antique Kimono Shop Yaya san, where you get to find the best selection of antique kimono in Kyoto. In this channel, we'll be introducing hidden gems in Kyoto. So, if you're a Kyoto lover planning to come to Kyoto someday, be sure to subscribe to enjoy more content. So, let's go. 中に入らせていただきましょう行きましょうアンティーキモノヤヤ is one of the most famous stores where kimono lovers gather from all over Japan although there are many kimono made today there is a large selection of antique kimono made in the early Showa period it is said that the kimono culture of the commoners in this period was the most gorgeous The lifespan of silk is said to be about 100 years, which means kimono from the early Showa period will soon be 100 years old in 2022. The kimono is carefully inspected by a kimono maker at the store, dry cleaned and retailed to sell in its best condition. How exactly are antique kimono different from modern kimono? What is the procedure for buying kimono in Kyoto? Let's find out. Inside of the store、wow. is beautiful. Beautiful, so many kimonos. <laughs> Oh, the hair ornaments. Very important part of your fashion when you wear kimono, yes. And also, obi jime, obi age, and obi dome. All small decorations are. Small decorations. Yes, in the front of the shop. They look antique too. ここのもあるの Kimono shop. Yeah. Yeah, oh, really? We usually buy kimono online. Oh,、so. uh, yes, that's right. That's right. Koko ga fudangi. No kajiaruna. The obi also gradually becomes more formal towards the back. The obi are arranged so that they match the rank of the kimono on the shelf above. Underneath the komon, which is a kimono to wear daily, there is a nagoya obi that matches with the kimono. Nagoya obi are easy to tie because their length is rather short. This obi is recommended if it is your first time buying one. What's there? Oh, there's more of the obi jime. Mmm, beautiful. They're、so、inside a showcase. Many... Yeah. Looks so gorgeous. Yeah, they're actually really, really big. Yeah. It's this big. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah. There's more bags in there,、mm. too. More bags in the showcase.、Amazing. And here is. Han Eri to Obiage. Here is. 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 えー、着れなくなってもまだ生地として使えるじゃあ、あといて何か小物を作りましょうとかっていうことを昔の人もしていたのでこの精神も白い襟が普通ですけどこうちょっと柄が入ってるものを着るとグッと雰囲気変わり
very, very different、mm. from the kimono we just saw on the other side of the、uh, shop. Very, very different. You can immediately understand that it's completely、yeah. a different style. ただ、縫いの糸も90年から昔のまんまやったりすると、縫いだり着たりっていうその練習に向くかなって思うとちょっと疑問なので、触ってもらうとぜひぜひ見てみて。生地感とかも全然違う。柔らかい。え、なんか
え、手触りが全然違う。はってなるよね。着物と違う。違う。すごいな、本当に。これ冬用の合わせですか。はい、合わせの着物で、えー、あの、その質問きっと。はい。てろんとした感じやから。そう。えー、これ本当に。冬物って思わなかったなと思うんですけど。はい。この時代はこうふわっと。あの羽のような軽い置物の方が上質と言われてたそうなんでなんか着てないみたいに本当に軽くて軽くてあーいすごいどうでしょうこんな感じですまずはすごいでこっちでも合ってないことはないんですけど、はい、結構コントラストがすごい強く出るので逆にこっち側の方がずっとこう馴染むっていうところはあるんではないかなというふうに思いますなるほどでまた帯が来るとすごいこのアンティークらしい感じでこれどっちも柄があるのに全然負けてないですね、はい、そうなんですよ梅の柄、はいはいお花の柄っていう、うんうん、確かにあのちょっと喧嘩するかなとも思うんですけどかなりこっち側の帯のがデフォルメされてるお花柄なんで、うん、あ,ありかな,なでこれで帯留めで梅持ってくるとかあなるほどそこでこうリンクさせたりとかっていう黒いうわかっこいいグッと大人っぽい感じ大人っぽいなりますね刺繍がすごいはい刺繍が見事なすごい、うん安心感がすごい。良<笑>かったです。あともちろんですけど、やっぱり着付けも早いですね。はい、<笑>確かに。裏地が真っ赤。すごい。The red lining of antique kimono are called momi, and it is a characteristic specific to kimono from the Showa period. In those days, red was used for many things that people wear, as it is said to be a color that protects you. For example, red cloth was used only for the maetsubo of zori sandals so that your feet will be protected. Red was also used for makeup for the eyes and mouth of Michael and for their costumes. こういうビビットな感じでパッと楽しまれるのもありですし、黒地でグッと締めるのもありです。黒って万能ですねやっぱり。可<笑>愛い,いそれ。わすごい。おお。うわすごい。すごい。ま、入りも素敵。うん。すごいぴったり。ぴったり。これ長くなった。ね。そこでがすごい、うん。こういう感じでちょっとはんなりとか。ああいいですね。これなどこれですか。どんな柄入ってますね。ボタンや桜に波に。あ,にあ本当だ。めでたい。めでたいですね。またまた。またまたあ、また、あ、バンド、バンドですね。バンドですね。You look so happy. I think it's really interesting that you get to try out so many different kimono, you know, very casually and easily because you can switch into different kimono very quickly, right? Yeah. So we're going to be asking her the price first. Yeah. 一万九千八百円。はい。三万三千円。はい。三万八千五百円。だいたいうちのあの平均金額の、はい、あの前後ぐらい。あ、なるほど。三万円ぐらいが平均金額かなっていう中で、帯の方がこの黒い万能なのが、はい、で四万一千八百円。のちょっと黄色いのが一万六千五百円。はい。でこちらが三万五千二百円。うんなるほど。これは仕立て替えをしていないものなんで一万六千五百円という値段ですが、でもそれでも十分に、これもどれも綺麗に仕立て替えしているので、はい、すごくこう長く締めていただける状態ではあります。So then,、uh, Tomoko, which combination was your favorite? My favorite kimono is This green one. Oh, the one that I said it would probably look the best on you. Yeah, I thought so too.、Mm -hmm. Before wearing,、mm -hmm. uh, my favorite one was this. Uh -huh, uh -huh. But after wearing, I 
like this one. Yeah, yeah. because especially because the kimono is, you know, such a long piece of cloth, right? Mm -hmm. It's a cloak. Yeah, so and when it's folded and when it's actually worn, it mm -hmm. looks completely different. Different. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, the green one, the kimono was your favorite. Yes. Mm -hmm. How about the obi and the hainanese then? Obi? Yep. My favorite one is yellow one. Oh, the yellow mm. one? Mm. Mm. Yeah. I like the combination. Both are flowers, yes, right? Yes, 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 yes. But it matches. Mm. It's beautiful. Mm. <gasps> ah! 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 It's a jewelry shop. <laughs> <laughs> そう、こういうのでこう季節感を出すとかっていうのも楽しいと思います。なんか毎回着て着物の時ってそういう関連付けて楽しむとか、ゆりちゃんの誕生日のお祝いやから、ゆりの持ち風どこか見るよとか。な
そうかわいそうですけど<笑>でもそういう組み合わせの方がグッときますよね。Okay, so my three kimono are decided then.、Yeah. This one's the one that I, def- I fell in love with immediately,、mm-hmm. the one with the bells, and the one that Harumi said she liked the most here with the Haori set. Yeah. So I'm going to be trying these three on.、Yeah. Awesome. はい。では最後に羽織がありましたね羽織紐も男性もありますので特にこのサイズ感がこれがすごい<笑>こんな巨大な羽織ともあるんですね,すねというのはやっぱこう袴の時とかだと下にプレアでボリュームがあるのでこれぐらいボリュームがあってもバランス良くなりそうですがやっぱりこの感じで加工美してですと、はいこれぐらいスッキリしてるものの方がちょっと色も入ってるんですね、はい、でもそ,そうなんですよこれ,これが完全にもう続行でしたね<笑>これに完全にではよろしくお願いしますイエーイナチュラルな雰囲気がなんか結構好きで、うんはい、今探しているのは名古屋帯と長羽織をちょっと探してて、はい、こういうグレーっぽい感じの着物着てありますよ、ね、持ってます持ってますじゃあこれでちょっと帯見ていただくと分かりやすいと思うので、はい、あ名古屋帯 is a type of 帯 that can be worn casually for going out for a little bit like a bottom up shirt the staff selected five 帯 that would go well with this 着物 Three of them were dyed and two were woven. A dyed obi is made by first weaving white fabrics and then dyeing it with colors and patterns later. A woven obi is made by directly weaving multiple threads dyed in various colors. Even if the type of obi are the same, a woven obi is considered to be more prestigious than a dyed one. 
On the other hand, for kimono, dyed ones are higher ranked more than woven ones. So it is often said that it is best to match a dyed kimono with a woven obi, or a woven kimono with a dyed obi. あの、そのなるほど。<笑> <笑>今時そうですね。同系色で合わせてます。結構。<笑><笑> Although this is not required, there is an advanced etiquette for wearing kimono more stylishly. It is to wear kimono and obi that have patterns in season. For example, a graphic cherry blossom pattern is considered more chic to wear in spring, just before the cherry blossoms are in full bloom. This action is based on the idea that when the cherry blossoms are actually in full bloom, people should not stand out more than the real cherry blossoms. However, kimono and obi with seasonal patterns can only be worn for a short period of time. Therefore, abstract patterns, non-photorealistic flowers and grasses, and those with multiple seasonal patterns can be worn all year round, since they do not determine a specific season. Having kimono and obi like these gives you extra width to your fashion coordination. Uh, hi. Uh... ちょっとこう、なんで、なるほど。それで雪の部分を長くしたい。そうなんですね。時間とか柄の雰囲気とかを考えて、アート。はい。すごい。すごい。え、そうなんですよ。ハッピーな。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すごい。すご
。ねえ。さっきの言ったちょっと竹は短めですね。あ、確かに確かに。はい、ここにあるお花の影みたいな。あ、確かに確かに。見えるというか。さすがのセンス。うん。黒は万能。万能っていう感じですね。安心。マリですかね。そうですね。マリと。とモミジ。はい。秋口。まあ、赤じゃないもみじもあるので。秋と断定しなくても大丈夫と、えー。なるほど。ますね。今、つくすと大体帯にすごく合ってると思う。うんうんうん。確かに。そう思って。普段の花になったら、多分その黒だよね。正解。で<笑>も<笑>、これまた帯が変わると、見え方変わってくるんで。あ、えー、帯変えて、もう一回。パパッと羽織ってみられる。あ、はい、じゃあ、お願いします。はいこれを引っ掛けを取るだけで、こんなの二百円とかで売ってるので、えー、絶対持っといた方がいいですね。ちなみにお値段お聞きしてもいいですか。はい、さっき置物は猫を置きした通り、河川で五千五百円、はい。帯がちょっとボールペンの跡が出ないところだったんですけど、はい、あったので一万一千円とかなりお値段。そうなんですね。はい、買い出しお値段になってます。帯締めが1100円香り紐が400円500円に消費税、うんうん、そして一番メインになる香りが税込みで4万1800円3万8000円に消費税なのですごいありがとうございます、はい、ありがとうございました So we have decided、yes. <laughs> So, Tomoko is going to be buying the Hanedi and Obiage. Yeah. That's the colorful color that she had.、Yeah. First time buying a Hanedi for you, right? First time. First time for you,、yeah. right? Yeah. And also, what's this again? <laughs> it's Kan, it's called? For h a o r i Himo. Oh, for the h a o r i Himo, too. Okay, some small items. And also for Harumi, you chose the Obi. Yes. <laughs> exactly. This is the Obi that you wanted. Exactly, exactly. I just fall in love with this. Very, very good. Yep. And I actually fell in love with this kimono here.、Yeah. I just thought I could not leave this shop without him. So <laughs> I am taking him home with me today. I chose the kimono. Yep. All right. So then we'll get this all wrapped up and it's about time we have to go. So, we just got out of the antique kimono yaya san. <laughs> it was an amazing experience. Of course, you guys saw us you know, choosing the kimono and having a lot of fun you know, putting it on and such. But I think the best part was definitely that the owner、mm. she actually saw a lot of our videos and she knew which kimono that we usually wear. And she chose all the items depending on the kimono that we usually wear in our other videos. 
So that's how much research she did for us. Mm. You can definitely feel her hospitality and her kindness and friendliness and everything from that too. So I was very, very touched. Yeah. How about you, honey? I think you enjoyed it a lot too. I found the uh, OB that I'm looking for for a long time. Yes, yes, you were yeah, saying. I just fall in love with the OB uh -huh. and all the kimono is just my taste. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I yes. just really love this shop. Of mm -hmm. course, the staff was so kind and knowledgeable. Yeah, I will definitely come back again. Perfect. Yeah. And lastly, from you, Tomoko? Yeah, it was like looking at art in a museum. Definitely, yeah, definitely. definitely. Mm. I completely agree with you. The period mm -hmm. that antique kimono is warm mm -hmm. was when the culture of clothes was just coming in. Mm -hmm. and the That's right aesthetic sense of Japanese people changed yeah. a lot. Mm -hmm. So it was interesting to understand that from the kimono yeah. that were yeah. worn in the period. Mm -hmm. mm. Exactly. And I highly recommend this shop. Yes. Yeah. Definitely. We do too. We do too. We do too. Mm. Right. So now everyone, if you are interested in finding your first kimono or any antique kimono that you like, Coming here to Kimono Yasan will be an awesome idea, so please check out our description box the link to their website. Hey. And our goal is to achieve 1 million subscribers by January 2023, so your help would mean a lot. And we'll see you in our next Kyoto Hidden Gems. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Bye bye.